Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Nat Salar and welcome to Natsi Style. If you like this video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Also, don't forget to hit that little bell button so that you can be notified every time when I post a video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I got from this to this. I'm also going to try out these two products from Benefit. I've already cleansed and moisturized my skin and now I'm going to put some primer using the Porefessional Hydrate Primer from Benefit. This is a really good product if you have dry skin like me. I find this product really good because it's not too dry. Next, I'm applying this Ila Masca Skin Base Foundation. I love, love this foundation. However, as you can tell right now, the foundation is too dark for me right now, but I will try to make it work. So stay with me until the end of the video. For concealer, I'm using this Fit Me Concealer by Maybelline. I like this applicator. I think it's so convenient and it is so tiny so it can go to the very um, narrow area like the inner corner of your eye and it is great to spot conceal your blemishes. Moving on to brows, I'm going to start out by using this brow setter from Benefit. I used to only apply this product after my brows are drawn, but now I'm doing it in a reverse way. So I'm going to apply this product and then draw my brows after. Once it's dry and set, I'm going to use this Oto Eyebrow Pencil from Innisfree and I'm going to draw strokes following my hair direction. And I've just realized that I've forgotten to set my concealer. And I'm using the No Sebum Mineral Powder from Innisfree. I love this product. I think I've bought like five of them. And I'm actually on my fifth one right now. Normally, I will move on with my eye makeup. But today, I've decided to do my face first. So, bronzer! And of course, the Hula Bronzer by Benefit. And there you go. Kika is on board, apparently. And he just want to come by and say hi to all of you. So hi, everyone. This is Hika. And I just went ahead and continue contouring my face. Well, nothing has changed. I'm still contouring my face exactly the way that I used to do. I'm loving them, so I don't think I'm going to change anytime soon. And I'm also applying this Hula Bronzer on my eye. This is like a transition shade for me. I apply Hula Bronzer on my eye all the time. It's really like the perfect shade for a transition. I also run this product under my eye. Next, I'm applying this golden peach blush called Georgia from Benefit. Ooh, it actually smells really good. It smells like fragrance. Picking up Sugar Bomb from Benefit, I'm gonna apply this on the apple of my cheeks. This one's got four shades. You can choose to apply these four shades separately and make it like a really nice eyeshadow color but I'm using all-in-one to achieve this rosy pink cheeks. I've recently just picked up this new technique um, just to apply the blusher on my nose and I'm amazed how pretty it looks. And then I'm gonna curl my lashes using the curler from Muji. And then apply mascara. This is the Hyper Curl Mascara from Maybelline. My favorite. 
Moving on to eyeliner, the Line Tattoo Crayon Pen by Maybelline. I'm applying this in my waterline. And then using an angle brush, I'm gonna tap the product on the brush and then draw my wink with it. This is one of the best techniques I've learned from Pixie Woo. They are my favorite makeup artist. Now I'm gonna dab on the lightest shade from Sugar Bomb and put it in my inner corner of my eyes, um, the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow, and my cheekbones, and my brow bones. I always miss that out. On the lips, I'm using the Soft Wanna Wonderstruck in Dusk. I love this shade. I think it compromised my entire look. It is perfect to mesh with my blusher and my eyeshadow. I love that it does not stand out too much. It's not too bright or too nude. It's just perfect. And I'm overdrawing it a little bit on my cupid's bow. I saw Amber Shaw doing it and I love it i noticed that the foundation is way too dark for my skin right now so i went ahead and add the bronzer on my shoulder and my chest just to even out a little bit Hush. all right guys thank you all so much for watching and i hope you love this look Please don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment and tell me how you think about this look and I shall see you on my next one.